Hey guys, welcome back. So today I want to discuss a topic that's very difficult, but it's essential. How to move forward after failing your ASW license exam. The first tip I would give you is accept your emotions. It's completely normal to feel upset or disappointed. Give yourself permission to experience these feelings fully. It's part of the process and it's okay to take some time to cope. The next thing I will tell you is assess your performance. Review your score report to identify what are the areas that I'm struggling with. This can help you develop a more targeted study plan for the next attempt. The next tip I would give you is revise your study strategy. Consider changing your study approach. Maybe you need more questions. Maybe you need more study material that fits your learning style. Maybe you need a study group. Whatever that is, you want to identify what didn't work so you can work on what's going to improve your study plan the next time around. Develop a new study schedule. Consistency is key when it comes to studying. You want to plan your study schedule well in advance of your next exam date. Make sure it's realistic and you want to leave some room for self-care. Okay guys, reach out for support. You're not alone in this journey. Reach out to your mentors, your peers, online communities. They can provide support, valuable advice, encouragement, and reassurance. I have a study group on Clubhouse on Mondays, so you can feel free to join that. You want to also take care of yourself. Remember, self-care is crucial during this time. Your stress can affect your preparation and your performance. So make sure you're looking after your physical and mental health. So overall, remember that failing exam doesn't define you or your capabilities as a social worker. It's a setback, but it's not the end. Learn from it, use it as fuel to push you forward. Okay, guys? So I hope that was helpful to you, and I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys.